Welcome to AD Connections. AD Connections is the job framework which gives you a career pathway within our business. Every role has a job level. You'll find your job level listed on your job description. You can move through the AD Connections framework in various ways. Dependent on where your role sits in the current framework, you can move into roles with job levels that horizontally, vertically or diagonally connect to your job level. Each role also has competencies attached to it. These are also listed in the job description. Competencies are behaviours or skills and they are transferable across roles. For example, customer focus is a skill needed to be successful in our sales advisor roles. It is also a skill needed in our category management team. Competencies are transferable and are what enable you to move between roles and departments. All roles grow in complexity over time. So even if you want to stay in your current position, it's important you keep developing so you can continue to perform in role. Our new appraisal process is called AD Connected. Through this process, you can identify where you want to go, what skills you need to get there, and then build a plan of how to develop those skills. Developing and learning shouldn't be hard. 70% of what you learn, you should be able to work on in your everyday role. 20% of what you learn will be taught to you by others. That could be people you know, colleagues or experts. 10% of what you learn will be from formal learning, but this can be as simple as watching a video. You need to be clear on what you want to develop and how you're going to do that. And the AD Connected template will help you. Review the competencies on your job description. Look them up in the competency handbook and work out which one you need to work on. This is your what. Next up is your why. What's your start point? You're from. And where are you going to? You're to. Once you know you're from and to, it's time to build your plan. The how. Plan and note down your 70-20-10. There are plenty of suggestions on how to cover all three of these areas for each competency in the competency handbook. Just select the ones that are most relevant for you or create your own if you'd prefer. Finally, set a timescale, your when. It can take anything from three months to two years to develop a competency, so be realistic. As well as developing your competence or behaviours, it's important to keep building your technical skills too. So repeat the what, why, how and when exercise using the AD Connected template, thinking about specific skills you need in your role. For example, if you work in store, you may need to brush up on your Epicor knowledge. If you work in digital marketing, you might want to work on Google Analytics. Ahead of your conversation with your manager, you should have given some thought to what competency you'd like to work on and how you might do that. Your manager will do the same exercise and then, when you meet, you can compare notes and agree a plan. Be open to feedback and suggestions. Development is not a once a year conversation. It happens every day. The little steps add up. Make notes of your development in your AD Connected document over the course of the year. Note down even the small things as over a period of time this will help you see how you're doing. Are you ready to start planning for your next role? You'll find all job descriptions on the shared drive. See what competencies you need for your dream role and build them into your development plan. There's also an abundance of training material available to help support your development. By being clear on what you're working on and how you're going to do it, you'll be clear on when you've reached your goal. Good luck.